Would you like to surprise your friends with a unique piece of decor for this Halloween? Let me show you how to make this unique and very, very creative <laughs> Halloween candle. Let's dive into it. So today I'm using this wine glass that I got from Big W that we have here in Australia. And what I'm doing now, I'm measuring, because I have this Halloween silicone mold and I'm measuring which uh, what I want on top of my candle. And I decided to go with the ghost one. No, sorry, not the ghost one. <laughs> The skull one. The ghost does. I don't think it fits. I want something that actually fits in my uh, in my wine glass. So I I decided to go with the skull. Now the next step that I'm doing, I'm I'm mixing some Mod Podge, which is a, a glue and a sealant with the, some acrylic black paint. And I'm doing two parts of Mod Podge and one part of acrylic. And now I'm starting to paint my um, my wine glass, and I didn't show you, but of course I cleaned my my glass. And so now I'm starting from the bottom to paint the glass, and then I'm going up. And all around. Now it's time to go a little bit more like lower part of the glass, I guess. <laughs> And guys, if you're new to my channel, hello, welcome. Don't forget to like this video if you like it. Otherwise, dislike it. If you don't like it, at least I know what you guys like and want to see. And don't forget to subscribe. And uh, yeah, I hope you stick around because I make really fun projects with a lot of fun candles. <laughs> so now, um, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm joking. I'm just like kind of drawing some line because basically, guys, if I have to be honest with you, and I love to be honest with you, um, I, with this type of uh, project that I do, I really many times I just go with the flow. Like I have an idea in mind, but I don't, I never done it. It's my first time doing something like this. So I'm just, you know, uh, kind of, yeah, going with the flow and see how it turns out. So I, I did, you know, these these lines, um, and now I'm doing like a, um, a second layer of the same color and mod podge, and you're gonna see like in the video. But I'll change the design a little bit because, yeah, I have to see. It, let's say I I have to try and see what I like. So now I'm doing the second layer even. Uh, that part of the glass and here I'm making my lines a little bit like that darker and thicker and here uh, longer even longer because yeah, I decided they were too short, so I wanted longer lines. I waited maybe a couple of hours. My Mod Podge was ready, so I was ready to go like to do another layer on top and that's what I'm doing right now and yes one important thing is that the Mod Podge is uh, is white when you work with it right so when you use the like the black acrylic the color will be gray 
because of course black and white but then the good thing is that the Mod Posh dries clear so the glass will be black so don't worry if you know while you're painting it is gray and you know don't, don't put more black acrylic basically so now this is the moment when I decided that I want a more I don't know like a, maybe like more shades or darker effect so I decided to draw as you can see in the um, it's hard to, to explain but you can see <laughs> in the um, where there was you know where there wasn't painting basically to do some like more gray or lighter black uh, lines I don't know I thought it will make the design a little bit nicer So that's how it turned out and I really loved it to be honest and here I wanted to give some because the Mod Podge is a glue and has some texture to it so I wanted to do some some you know not straight lines basically here I'm putting my my wig placing my wig it's a cotton wig I am this is the wax that I'm gonna use to do the first one is the one I'm gonna use for the for my wax melt so it's not wax melt but the, the skull and I need a harder wax and the other one in the big pot is the wax I'm using for the actual candle I'm using a pumpkin spice latte fragrance from Aroma 8% and here I'm measuring my wax I did 200 grams of wax 8% fragrance oil and I put yes if you're asking maybe you don't care <laughs> but if you ask I'm, I put fragrance oil even in the in the skull so here I put two drops of, um, of red color the red color I got it from candle supply and I'm stirring 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 I tried the color but it was too light for me so I decided to add a little bit of black with a um, with a cotton how do you call that cotton stick I don't know what's the name I forgot <laughs> sorry it's late <laughs> I'm editing this video while my baby's sleeping at night time so <laughs> because I wanted a darker red so I mixed two like two drops of red and a little bit of black I didn't want a black color of course but I want a darker red now I pour my wax in and the wax that, that I was soaking before in the little in the little pot that's what I use for my skull and I also made um, like a ghost as you can see because I was like I can use it for something else if the skull you know it's no good doesn't turn out good So now I'm taking out my skull and I'm poking a hole through his nose so I can put the, the wick through and I waited the wax was you know like not how do you say like was solid it wasn't liquid otherwise it would have gone you know down but it was a little bit a little bit liquidy on top let's say and here is I told you I go with the flow <laughs> this is when I decided to that I want to paint my uh, my skull and yeah I took some black acrylic and just you know I'm drawing the, the mouth the nose I think it's cool because the, the wig <laughs> is the nose so I didn't need to draw the and this the is nose, uh, yeah acrylic the, paint the teeth I guess the same I use for the for the glass and now I'm painting the the eyes and if someone is wondering because I was wondering like can you actually paint with acrylic on candles so I didn't know like I was checking online and they said yes but I wanted to experiment this uh, YouTube channel is about tutorial and experiment so that's what I did I put as you can see a little bit of black color on this lid and I try to 
set on fire <laughs> but it didn't catch on fire so I guess you can use acrylic on candles <laughs> So this is the final candle with my scalp. So guys, let me know what do you think. Well, thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you guys think. If you're gonna make it, if you're gonna make something else. And I will see you in my ne next project. Ciao guys. <laughs>